Hello. Hi. Welcome back. Uh, I am Ignatius Forty Seven on Internet. Gerald in not Internet. I guess I'm Gerald in the Internet too. He's Gerald and Ignatius Forty Seven. That's me. I'm Melanie. My lovely wife. Um, last weekend, today being the... Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. So this past Saturday, we took a road trip two and a half, three and a half hours away. Give or take. To Jungle Gyms. We had never been there. We nope. live far away from big cities. Indeed. So we took a road trip and we thought that we would do an off video instead of our Universal Yums. Mm -hmm. This is just the whole shebang of what yes. we got so at Jungle Gyms. There were a handful of things that we got that we're not gonna be showcasing for reasons that should be obvious. It's like the, uh, we got some oils, like cooking oils. We got some olives. We, we can't really taste those. We got some um, cheeses. We got olives and cheeses. We're doing and prepackaged foods. That kind of thing. Uh, we're doing prepackaged food. All of this now uh, to give you a little bit more of a background. Jungle Gems is a place that has, of course, it has a big section of just regular U.S. Yes. groceries. But there's a there's like what is it, like twelve ish aisles. I don't know what I'm talking uh, about. Or, or a lot of so aisles of foreign items. Countries uh, represented countries, in aisles. Yeah. Like one aisle is Turkey, one aisle is India, Indeed. and Indeed. so on and so forth. This. We're gonna just, we're gonna just jump in because we don't have any like trivia or anything with this. It's just gonna be straight food tasting. Um, this is a coconut candy. And comment treat. if you recognize any of these foods and you've had them. Yeah. Comment. I think this was from the Mexico section. Yes. Yeah, considering it is in Spanish, but it could be other things too. It could be from Spain. Made in Mexico. Uh, Mexico. It's super tiny. Right? It is. <laughs> Okay. Uh, we have scissors and the other assorted things. I have no idea what things. flavor it is, but I'm assuming it's either raspberry or strawberry, but I don't know. It's entirely coconut uh, with a bit of artificial color and some... Hmm. It might just be straight coconut. You mind if I go first? No, please. Please, by all means. Is it delightful like that other thing we got from, uh, where was, what was that other thing from? Taiwan? Mm -mm, it was, uh, it was the UK. UK, yeah. Okay, yeah. It's very good until midway through. It's weird. So, it's, it's straight up a bar of coconut. It's almost pure coconut. It's like, whoa. See what I mean? Like halfway through, something tastes weird. It's like you can taste the dye almost. Mm -hmm. Like plasticky, maybe? Um, I'm good on that. Very mm. rich. Not great. We don't have a million cups of water this time. Just no, because, because we have drinks that we're going to try in a little mm -hmm. bit too. Ugh, that was gross. Wow. Okay. Um, it's like almond joys minus the chocolate almonds and, and minus the lovely taste. General, <laughs> that's the chocolate. Um, it's gross. We're gonna go now into the more uh, savory, savory items. Let's stick with Mexico. Okay. This is oh. also in the aisle, in Mexico. It has a flying cheesy hoof. Made yes, it does. And super churros. So it's just Mexican. This phone's ringing. It literally smells like his regular cheesy poops. Sorry. I'm sure. Sorry, guys. I I'm hope sure. we don't get copyright flagged for the Firefly theme song. I'm wearing a Firefly <laughs> shirt. Oh! Ow. Smell. Whoa. Super cheesy. I don't know why they used the word churros. I gotcha. We're gonna dink it. We're gonna oh, dink we're this one. Gonna dink it. Because the other one was just a solid chunk, so we're gonna dink this. This is very cheesy looking. Mm. So. Mm. 
it has a different flavor, but it's still texture. I think it tastes, the aftertaste is different. Like it's a little burnt almost. I think it ha It tastes like there's garlic. Mm, I can mm. see that. It's base. It tastes to me. It tastes just like the the. What, what brand? I'm good right now. I'm you good. don't like these anyway. I'm these not a big fan me. of cheese boots, uh myself. But more mm. power to you. Yeah. That's like the. Is it hers or Snyder's or something? Brands like that. Her. Uh, not hers, Cheeto brand. Snyder's, it um, tastes a little different, but it's. Yeah. I like it. It's close to Cheeto brand, but it's again, it's not quite there. <clears throat> oh, yes, thank you. Right. You choose next. We want okay. You. Where are we Let's going next? Let's do. You want to try some plantain chips? Yeah. What, what aisle was that in? Honduras. Honduras. Uh, plantain. Sambos. Salvajes del Tropico. These are just plain ridged plantain chips with salt. Mm -hmm. Now, if you don't know what a plantain is, where have you been? I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, it's, uh, it's like a banana, but it's not sweet, and it's generally you cook it normally. It's, it's cooked. It's not something that you eat raw. Well, the smell is intriguing. Sorry. Rude. I'm so rude. Hmm. Look, you can see the middle part of yeah, the banana in this nest. All right, ready? Mm-hmm. I'm confused. It's like... Hmm. It makes sense. It's kind of like... An old cooked banana. <laughs> With salt. I'm sorry, I interrupted you. No, no, you're actually you're absolutely right, actually. Um, it's like an old. It's like a banana that they took all the sugars out of, like the fruit based sugars out of, and just substituted salt. Not, uh, not great, but it's not horrible either, you know? There, there are worse things that we've had. It's your turn to pick, my dear. There's so much here. I <laughs> know. We spent entirely too much money. Is that sweet or not? I don't know. Let's try. This is from the Japan Sesame. Is it mochi? Section mochi. 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 It's the it's the super marshmallowy substance. Extra gooey marshmallow. <laughs> Don't hurt yourself. We should have had these boxes open beforehand. This is part of the fun of doing things like this, is actually trying to figure out how to open it. No, uh, it's aggravating. Just, to me, it's aggravating. And hopefully for you it is, too. Yeah, it would be. It's just like in a, oh, okay. It's in a plastic container that's sealed in more plastic. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are there, are there only six? <laughs> uh, that's why we got the scissors theory. Shut it. Okay, so like they were put into it. Oh looks, my gosh. This it looks like plastic does not clean well. Yeah. It looks like it was put into cupcake paper. Yeah. Uh and in fact that's what it was. Uh oh. That one for me. Oh, that smells wonderful. It does. Um, if you don't like sesame seeds, this is not for you. No, because it is literally coated on. It is entirely uh, sesame seed based. I'm just going to go all in because it's, <laughs> it's bite sized. For you. Mmm. 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 You know what the inside looks like? Is it chocolate? I don't know, it's all in Chinese. Japanese. Japanese. <laughs> sorry. Come on. I'm sorry. I don't know. Rude. 
You're not going to read it. Sesame, peanut, peanut, red bean, sugar, and other stuff. So, no. Red bean? Really? Do I have the chocolatey? Um, mm -hmm. kind of taste to it. That was very good. How strange. Mm. Very rich. You literally only need one of these, but that's delightful. I'll leave that for you. You're more about the sesame than me. Um, I'm going to finish chewing it. Seeds stuck Goodness. in my teeth. Mm, I'm making a mess. Hmm. If you didn't have. <clears throat> Thank you. Hmm. If it wasn't covered in sesame seeds, it'd be the kind of thing that would be really good, like slightly roasted on, over a fire. Um with like graham crackers and Hershey bars. It would make a nice s'mores mushroom, mushroom, marshmallow uh, <laughs> placement. Don't put mushrooms <laughs> on s'mores. Don't do it. It's a bad idea. Gross. Um, I wouldn't be surprised mm. if, if that's happened on like Brett and Link, but uh, I wouldn't recommend it. That was delightful. Mm. All right. We're gonna bounce. We're bouncing all over the place here. Mm -hmm. Number one, I forgot what we got. Half of this stuff, <laughs> as far as like what I we didn't really organize it. This is from the UK. Tato, with a brand label. I'm covering up my face. Ha ha ha. The brand label that looks similar-ish to Lay's. No, not that one. That's the Walkers. That's the Walkers. That's Walkers. Okay. We'll showcase that. Mm -hmm. Pickled onion flavored potato crisps. I hope it's as airy as what it was in the UK box to be so young. I'm pretty sure it was. We went, okay, so part of why I went to Jungle Gems was for purposes of trying to find some more of that chip from the UK. And the only they kind, were amazing. the only kind they had was, was the haggis. The haggis. Grossness. And it was like, come on, man. That was literally from the Universal Young's weird. box. That was the only one that they had. Mm. Yeah? Pickle chips. Pickled onion chips. Thank you. Mm-hmm. They look just as airy as the other ones. Boop. Boop. Oh, the god. Woo. Mmm. That's so awful. Okay. Amazing. Um, it's like if you took sour cream and onion, I added dill, um, minus, of course, the sour cream, which is pickled onion, so that's exactly what it is. But this is the kind of thing that if you're not careful and you eat a whole bunch of it, will give you mouth sores. It's so salty. They're all for you. <laughs> and I, I figured you wouldn't care much for it. <clears throat> Would you like to try one of the drinks now, or do you want to save it? One. Again, we're bouncing. Yeah, we're bouncing. Uh, we're gonna save. We, we got a maple cream one from somewhere. Um, we're probably gonna save that one for last. Maybe even toward the end. Product of, of our, Mexico. When we're tasting. This is Jumex. Jumex you can find actually at some local grocery stores. Is it really um, Jumex or is it Humex? It's probably Humex, but we're we're in America. Is this carbonated? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, no. It is just like so juice. So I should. It's just like juice. Uh, you don't have to. I don't think you have to. It says it contains 21% juice. So. I don't know what the other. What is that? 79. Yeah, thank you. 29%. Math. Who knows? Here, you go first. Okay. Uh, so it is. This is the peach nectar. Uh, fly, sorry. This is a peach nectar version. Uh, it is made from concentrate, and it has uh, 42 grams of carbs. Holy crap! Uh, per can, so it doesn't play. Drink up. Is it sour? Uh, no, not really. It's thick. It's a little thicker. Mm. It's a little thicker. Um, than like normal 
It is. One more drink. I see why there's that 40 some oh, yeah. grams. That's it's thick because of all the because sugars. Because it's they delicious. Put in. It is. It's it actually to me, and it's probably similar for the other things, mm. but it tastes like the juice that they put into like the canned pups. canned peaches. Or the, the yeah. little plastic cups. Yeah. yeah. That's exactly what it is. Mm. That's very good. It is. <clears throat> All right. All right. What's up next? Well, um, I think I should drink next time so you get the... Oh, oh, this is from Thailand. We just had the Thailand box. We did, but they didn't have these. So this is a unique snack that we found. Fried... Fried pumpkin chips. Fried pumpkin chips. Now, this is the season for pumpkin stuff. Yes, I'm so excited. Um, maybe if you guys want, and please comment on this if you do want to see this maybe we can get a bunch of pumpkin flavored stuff i do like a pumpkin food we'll see about that just yeah. an idea yeah if you wanted if you wanted to see us do it comment let us know these don't really have much smell and they're super airy they look to me like this stuff like plastic wrap <laughs> or packing packing stuff yeah it looks like packing stuff or it could be the stuff like before it's cereal. Like, uh -huh. like yeah. Ready? <sighs> Sorry. Are you okay? I'm just a little gassy. Alright, here we go. Mm. It's all you dear. They're so airy. Mm. And they're not super sweet. They have give me one more redness. <laughs> They have a nice sweetness. Mm. Um, are these flavored or are they just plain? Just regular? Heck if I know. Mm. I don't know it. There's allergy advice. You know what the taste reminds me of? And not the texture. because it's. There's only it's, 9 grams of carbs in this. <clears throat> How many servings? The whole pack. Nice. Oh. Two. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Still, that's pretty good. The taste reminds me, it's very reminiscent of uh, the cone, what are the cone chips called? Fun, uh, fun? Funyun? No. I don't know, but these are delightful. Oh, they're, they're the little cones, you can bite them off and make, make, make little horns. <laughs> bugles. And you make the little... Bugles. Yeah. Yeah, bugles, it tastes kind of like bugles. Like regular bugles. Ooh, yeah, you can smell that. Mm-hmm. Mm. Very, very sugary. It is. I'm bouncing off the walls tonight. Okay. What you want to do next? You pick. Let's do. We've already done that. What is. Uh, okay, we have another pickled onion chip. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the Walkers. Which that is looks like the Lay's brand. Totally. What you. Totally the Lay's brand. <laughs> um. Oh, my dear. Great British potatoes. Store in a cool, dry place. These are best before October 13th. They'll be gone before then. <laughs> <sighs> oh my, I, I, I cracked it open and it immediately hit me with the smell. Those actually smell better than the others. It's a big chip. Is there a smaller one? There are smaller ones. Pick your chip. <laughs> there. Thank you. Okay. Here we go. Uh, uh. Those are better. I agree. They're not as like water your tongue in salt right. and hurt your tongue. These are mm. um they are crunchier. They actually taste more like an American potato chip. Yeah, but they're still, they're a little airy. They're not as airy as the ones that were in the, the box from UK. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the salt, I'm probably going to have a little. Oh, super salty. Yeah. Whew. We, we like just recently had dinner, so this is getting a little hard for me. It's been about an hour. hour and That's half. fair. Oh, okay, yeah, let's do it. Sensation. Thai sweet chili. Thai, Where is chili. this from? Some this is in the UK. Oh, it's Walker's brand. It's right here. 
It's a very uh, sensual looking uh, bag design. That smells like dirty socks. Oh, now that you mentioned that, I can mm -hmm. totally. Uh huh. I told you. I don't know if I want to eat this now. <laughs> yes, you do. You're so rude. That's the strangest thing. Here we go. Boop. Ooh. Thankfully, it doesn't taste like dirty stuff. Um, it had a little kick on the end. Um, I think it's very good. It's not super spicy to me, but I'm from Louisiana. Um, I'm not. <clears throat> we from did. Louisiana. We did also get. I don't think we grabbed them. Um, because it's not super relevant. Because it's not really like a foreign thing, but. Oh, zaps. Um, we got some zaps. Some spicy some craw taters. Chips. Cajun craw taters. Um, spicy Cajun craw tater chips. Zaps are native to Louisiana. Um, They're delightful. Believe they have them there, and they are amazing. Um, there was a, a whole section there for like super hot foods, but we decided against <laughs> that. We sure did. Um, because we want me to live. There is such a thing as too spicy, and I'm, I'm good on all that. I'd, I'd, I'd much rather have flavor like those delightful chips. They're all you. Ah, you got it. We're going to finish this off by the time we're done. All right, my dear, what's next? Well, let's try the drink. This one? Yeah. Okay. Now, this one we thought was kind of cute and very interesting. Um, I don't know what that is. PRC? What country is that? Is this a product? Let me see. I can't really oh, see. Singapore. It's sing I, I Singapore. see it now. Okay. okay. This is a bottle of flavored water. Um, that is half bottle, half can. Show them the top. Oh, yes. <laughs> so, we, th we thought they were cool. And it's like... It's like very plastic. Total plastic. Um, we thought that we'd try it. Um, we got three different flavors. We're just going to try one. Here. We're just going to try one. We got cherry. Can you open that? Mostly because we don't know how well they're going to keep. Yeah. And we don't want to have all three open and not drink them. Yes. You know? Well, hand me the scissors. Yeah. Or use the bottle. I don't, I mean, I have nails, but that's the kind of thing that jacks your nails up. Ooh, nice. <laughs> we can get it open. We'll try it for you. Goodness gracious. This is pineapple flavor. Mm -hmm. It's sparkling clear. I hope it's not like LaCroix. Because <laughs> LaCroix is terrible. I'm, I take it from your face that it's not good. Are these all me too? Okay. If it wasn't fizzy, it would be a whole lot better. It's slightly fizzy. Yeah, it just has the faintest hint uh, of carbonation. Um, I actually like it. I think that if you get the pineapple stuff, um, it would be really good in like a pina colada, uh, if that's your jam. Uh, it's very good. I, I actually like it. I'm good on that. It's a very interest. It's it's a very light can because it's all plastic too. It's super yeah. weird. It's it is a strange uh, strange concept. And it, to be fair, it probably saves on uh, both plastic and metal consumption when creating it. But I don't know that. It is recyclable, so it shows. This is please don't litter on the top of it too. Uh, very good. Gross. Strange. <laughs> what about the cheese thingies? The flavors? Yeah, 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 yeah. Is flavors. that from the UK too? It's Walkers. So. Yes. Yes. Wait. 
contains no artificial colors. Curly little Please. things, quavers, and no two are the same. Some twistier, some that wrap around your tongue. But they're all crunchy and melty and pleasingly cheesy, so go on, pop one in your mouth. That's kind of terrifying in that <laughs> voice. Carrot, <laughs> Ooh. Yes, this is reminiscent of something we've had before. <laughs> it <laughs> smells like those jalapeno things they do. that we got in the uh, Taiwan box. Was it the Taiwan box? No, that was the UK box. I'm losing my mind, people. You're right. Start <laughs> starting to bleed together. Ready? Uh huh. Almost identical. Not as spicy. Different texture and not as spicy, which the other one wasn't spicy. It just had a, a little tiny. But. Mm. That's good. Mm. <clears throat> you know, whenever we visit overseas, we're going to have to take an empty suitcase just to bring back all the food we're going to buy. I'm just saying. <laughs> wow. Mm. We are almost done with all of our savory goodies. Mm -hmm. And then we move on to the chocolate. And chocolate. And the, some of it's not chocolate, but for the most part it Sweetness is. Sweetness stuff. Is this all that we have left? That's savory? Mm-hmm. Yes, I think. Nope. Did this is durian flavored? Oh, that's hilarious. I'm very excited to try these. This is going to be safer, too. <clears throat> What's durian? Durian is a fruit. Is that the stinky fruit? It's the stinky fruit. Okay, this. Oh, I'm sorry. This is called palm sticks. Sour cream. This is from... Germany. The nutrition facts are a sticker that they stuck to the back of the bag. It is. Which is, I, I did not expect that. Uh, and it is very It doesn't really smell like anything. Oh, they look like, um, they look like, they look like baby, like Barbie french fries or baby french fries. Lay's, if you remember this back in the day, Lay's used to make it was like potato straws, I think they called them. I don't them. remember that. They were like little slices, like little, little fries. Mm. What's the flavor? Sugar and onion? Sour cream. Um, you need okay. a couple of these to even taste it because they're so small. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Well. Maybe. Mm. Better. I can actually taste it now. Mm. That's a nice airy. It is. Airy. It tastes like, so, you know when you go to McDonald's and you get the little crispies at the end, mm -hmm. the bottom, that are like the best? Yeah. With sour cream. With sour cream. That's what it tastes like. Hmm. Mm. Those are good. <sighs> All right, my dear, what now? Our last potentially savory item. Potentially. I don't know how this is going to be. Um, I've only ever seen durian on Rhett and Link, and they have had a hard time with it. Especially on Link. Uh... I'm sorry, GMM. You know what I mean. All right, here we go. What does it smell like? Oh, oh, oh let God. me smell. Don't tell me yet. I'm not going to tell you. You have to smell for yourself. It smells like coconut body lotion. 
It's very strange, isn't it? What do you think it smells like? You know, I don't know. It's hard to place. It is. It's strange, though. It's very strange. These are hollow. Yeah, they're like strass. Why is yours a different color than mine? Mine's straight. Does mine have sesame on it? I don't know. Does this have sesame on it? Yeah, see? Jasmine. That's jasmine. Isn't that a flower? Okay. I got one that looks like yours. Okay. Sure. To be fair though, I'm still tasting the sour cream. You want another one? Sure. It's bizarre. The texture is perfect though. It it's does very have a very light nice. And airy. It's, it's like waffle cone. Mm -hmm. Um, it's jasmine rice. It does have a flowery hint. Um. Hmm. Potato Thailand. Not my favorite. I like these. Um, these are very good. Good are you, I think. Okay. I like those. I can... Ooh. Is it the jasmine? It may be the jasmine. I um, like them. Could be some of the other previous flavors all bleeding in. Mm -hmm. um, all right. We are done officially, I think, with the savory goodies. We are on we are. to the non-savory, i.e. the sweet things. These are from Germany. They have a um, unrepeatable uh, nickname in certain circles. Let's give this a try. Apparently it is some kind of uh, creamy, chocolatey... It looks like a bullet. Like, like, like the edge of a bullet. Oh, look at it. It's all like pretty. Ooh, like. Yeah, show that if you can. This is pretty. The the uh, the presentation is it's very, neat. very, very nice. Yeah, right, we're going to try like one of each. Carton. Yeah, we're going to try one of each. <laughs> what, do you, what do you think this is? All right. You want to go with dark chocolate first? Sure. Or. Oh, these are really light. Well, it's because they're like marshmallow. should have gotten two cups of water. I can do some work for you too. We're not prepared for this one because mm. reasons. So, hang on, before we delve into this one. That. So. The marshmallow um, is like. Gooey it's already. It's good. It's almost like it was melted, but it's cool. Um, and there's a kind of waffly. Waffle bottom. Bottom. Mm. Um, I'm not, we'll see how the other ones go. So far, I'm not like super into these. And they're all for me, which is great. This is white chocolate, I guess. Mm. See? That one is better. Mm. That is a dark one better. Dark chocolate, which is uh, in general. Mm, the aftertaste are better on that one. A more bitter. Mm -hmm. a more bitter chocolate um, it, it, it was good don't misunderstand me it was very good um, but the only thing I don't like and it's a, purely a texture nothing with taste is the waffle part on the bottom it tastes a little stale yeah and it's kind of like sticking yeah. in my teeth it feels it's not soft yeah it's well it's somewhere in between yeah like it it seems like it used to be you know a freshly 
crispy waffle piece, mm -hmm. and it's been in a box for a long time, and so it has, uh, it's like a little bill. That one is the best. This one? Mm -hmm. The milk chocolate one is the best in my opinion. Yeah. Mm. I like that box. Uh, it's a cool box mm -hmm. design too. These are delightful. Very, very good. Now, Melanie has never had Turkish Delight. Why is that such a big deal to you? Never. Uh, it's just, it's just an interesting point. What I see, I don't, I didn't, I don't even, I didn't even know what it was until. Um. So we got. We're gonna save this three, one for a little bit, or do we want to do this one now? Well, uh, let's talk about it. Okay. We got Sorry. three different ones. One is sesame chocolate. One is pistachio, and one is hazelnut. Mm -hmm. um, two, the, the pistachio and the hazelnut are more similar because they're the same brand. Um, I think, are these? Yeah, yeah these are, those are salt and brand. These are different brands. Okay. You want to do this one first then? Uh, sure. The sesame chocolate. <clears throat> Here. You want me to hold it? No, grab more. Can you huh? please grab more, please? Oh, yes. Whatever. While I'm opening this. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, we totally were not prepared on this because it's not like a regular Universal Yum's box, so. Mm. Sorry! Yeah, we underestimated how much drinkage we would actually be consuming. Yeah. How interesting. Mm -hmm. Almost dumped them out. <laughs> I don't want to do that. That would be bad. That durian, that durian crisp thing is sticky in terms of its flavor. It is. Thank you, dear. It has a tendency to last. Oh, sorry, guys. <clears throat> okay. Ooh. Is that like? Coated? I don't know. This is interesting. What's the big deal about this though? Like why explain that to me? It's just delightful. Okay. Is that why it's called Turkish Delight? Boop. <laughs> I told you. The sesame and the chocolate go strangely together um, to me. It's not bad. I like it. But it's very sticky. <laughs> it's very rich. Almost. Wow. Maybe we should have saved some of the savory stuff for in the middle. Well, maybe we can palate cleanse. <laughs> mm. You know, that's very good, but it's not my favorite yet. Mm -hmm. And these might not be. Those um, sesame mochi things, those were delicious. Yeah, it's like the, the red bean kind of flavor. You want to bust open one or the other? Ooh, okay. These are cocoa truffles. These are from France. Mm-hmm. Gluten-free. They yeah. look like a Chinese takeout box <laughs> without the little, <laughs> without the little thing. It does. That's it. 
It's like a potato chip bag. It really is. The box is deceptive. Uh oh. We're good. Ooh. Ooh. These are like cocoa. Oh, did I get chocolate? Did I get just get chocolate on my nails? <laughs> no, you're good. No, okay. not a sweet treat. Not really. Um, it's Wait. Good. This is the product of Canada. It's not what? French. France. Well, well anyway. same, yeah. It doesn't matter. It's not you at all. That very first taste though, because of where it's in chocolate with no sugar, is kind of tough to get through it's, the first couple yeah. seconds. It's so it's like if you put your, your fingertip mm -hmm. into like Hershey's mm -hmm. cocoa powder, mm -hmm. the non sweetened kind, and just stuff it in your mouth. Mm -hmm. uh, so but it's good. Yeah. Once you get that's it's, a very dense yeah. you literally only need one bite of that. Yeah, for a while, and, and you're good. <laughs> and we still have a couple more things to try. Okay. All right, let's try the hazelnut one next. All right. Oh, yeah, save the pistachio. I love and then pistachio. after pistachio, then we'll do that. Okay. So that's going to so, be our last one. Okay. We got, this is our last thing I'm going to try. It's uh, tiramisu rolled wafers. Mmm. I'm telling you that durian stuff sticks. I can't get it out of my mouth. You're supposed to open this with shut up skizzers scissor, <laughs> scissor that box all right this is hazelnut with cocoa nut That's how you open it. Mm -hmm. Like this. It's in an ice tray. <laughs> Literally, it's it in, an like it's in an ice tray. <sighs> yeah, just give it a little snippy snip. Just open. We'll push out a piece. It's a nice gooey glob. Actually, we can just use one piece if you want to just do that. Yes, please, because I'm getting a little. So I'm getting a little stuff. Smell it. version much better um same product of turkey it has mm. it has a consistency of almost like a brownie does that make sense that hasn't been baked all the way yeah like a mm -hmm. gooey brownie um and is very delightful but it's it, again it's one of those things that you eat like one Half of a one. Half of one. You're good. And then you're good for a while. Like it's not something that you. We have so much junk food. You eat a bunch of. I have a feeling that the pistachio uh, is going to be just as good, if not better. You love pistachio. I do. That's your jam. You like that in ice cream and all the above. Mm-hmm. He's right. It's his favorite ice cream flavor. But the problem with the ice cream flavor, which is opening this, um, is that it's really hard to find pistachio, like creamy pistachio ice cream. Usually it has little bits of pistachio. Oh, this is powder sugar. Same thing, ice tray. This one has powder sugar too, just perhaps not as much. <laughs> uh, we're doing one piece again. Yes, please. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yep. 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 Oh, careful. What? You get powdered sugar everywhere. Want me first? Mm hmm. You got powdered sugar everywhere. <laughs> mm hmm. Goodness, I did. starts to sink in. It's very good. Go to Jungle Gems and get all of the Turkish delights. Trust me. The sesame chocolate's all yours. I'm fine with that. Um, I like I like the other ones much better. Um, this one. I don't know if I can drink that right now. Well, what we're gonna do? We're gonna try a drink of it. We're gonna try a drink of it. We're gonna have. Maybe a little savoriness. You want to try the monkey heads? Uh -oh. I'm good right now. Okay. I don't know if I, I, I literally, I know we, I have room for one more sweet thing because I'm kind of getting a little sick to my tummy. I hear ya. I need to take some Pepto after this. <laughs> <laughs> I got a whole new thing in Tums at Walmart today. We're good. Wow. Wow. We got this, I don't know if we'll actually get around to trying it just because we're very sugared out right mm -hmm. now. The one thing left, we should have parsed it out, but we didn't because we're done. Um, yeah, that's me. <laughs> this was made in, yeah, this was made here. So yeah. We're just gonna, it's banana licorice. We got that down the Dutch aisle though, didn't we? Yeah, I think we did. Yeah, That's we funny. literally got this down the Dutch aisle. It's, maybe it's importers it's Dutch of fine style. Dutch products. Oh, okay. So imported maybe by Holland American. Oh, uh, it was imported. Yeah. So it's okay. So it yeah. is. So it, it is. is. It is for this. Mess. All right, last thing. <sighs> okay. Do we want to try the drink first? No, I'm just gonna drink the last if we can. Because I'm, I, it's gonna be amazing, and I, I really. I'm a lot more time. Oh my gosh, stop it. Uh, okay. Oh. Now, this is a product of Italy? I think we got this in the Italian aisle. Well, distributed. Can I, can I see that for a second here? Yeah, this? distributed by California. Ooh. Product of Indonesia. Indonesia. Oh, my tummy drama. Is that for me? Oh, we're going to start Sharon. Hang on. Oh, that durian aftertaste is so gross. I'm sorry, dear. Oh, I can't get it out. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like gooeyness in the middle. Gee. I'm glad we saved that for last. Mm -hmm. Probably the best thing we've had. That's been sweet. Um, I don't know, that hazelnut Turkish delight is pretty good. That is the kind of thing, and I think it's designed for this. You have one. But it'd be really good in like, coffee. Coffee. Really good in coffee. Uh, my tummy hurts. Mine too. We shouldn't do this. We, we should plan ahead differently next time. We do this for you, the fans. I feel so sick to my tummy. I need something salty. Mm hmm. Salty burnt choosy poos. Mm hmm. Is it Is a it? twist? I brought the bottle opener just in case. Um. <clears throat> Here, just come and use this. I think it is a twist, but. Got 
done it. Sorry, All right, show the front of it. This is made in New Hampshire. Um, it is maple cream soda. <sighs> it's amazing. It smells like syrup. Oh my gosh. Or in the southern colloquialism, syrup. Singular syllable. 40 grams of carbs. Oh, I'm 100%. I'm surprised I got more than that. <coughs> you may go first, you want to go first. Go ahead. <laughs> it's carbonated maple syrup. Wow. It's, uh... Not that good. Um, the aftertaste um. tastes like pancakes that you got in elementary school for breakfast. <laughs> it does. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh, okay. Or McDonald's pancakes, which they 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 make the syrup syrup in the pancake. A favorite drink that we've tried. I would this agree. This is very good. We have other flavors of that as well, but. My favorite, I have two favorite that I cannot choose between for savoriness is the fried pumpkin. Oh, those were so good. And the burnt cheesy poofs. Yeah. Those are my favorite. I gotta, I gotta stick with my, my pickled onion ones for that. I yeah. Think. Something that is both savory and sweet is this, the fir first thing that we tried the sesame mochi, which is out of reach right now. But that is very good. And then the hazelnut mm. Turkish delights were my favorite. I have consumed so much sugar right now that I feel a little lightheaded. Yeah. Whoa. So what's your favorite? Oh, hang on, let me focus. <laughs> <laughs> um, Can you even some more pistachio? Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> leave that over there. I'm taking another sip of this though, because I'm down. Yeah, you are dumb. Okay, so what's your favorite? Mm -hmm. That was stupid. It's How did like, you do that? It's so bland. It's like carbonated water. It's like <laughs> seltzer water <laughs> that has the aftertaste of pancakes. It's not very good. Okay, what's your favorite? It's weird. Hey, I'm focus. delaying. Oh, yes, you are. Um, focus. Shush. Hey, that's just rude. No, stop. Okay. My favorite savory thing I have to say is going to be either the Walkers or the Tato uh, pickled onion Which chips. one? Like the Walkers better? Yeah, probably. It has more of a crunch. Mm -hmm. I like the crunch. It's nice. And for the sweet, honestly, if, okay, the Turkish Delights are all really, really good. And the pistachio one has a texture more of a caramel than of like a brownie. It does, yeah, um, like a soft caramel. Like a soft caramel. Yeah. It is, um, it's, it's also interesting because the flavor profile changes the longer you chew it. You get more so, of the pistachio yeah. flavor the longer you chew it. It starts out almost like just straight up powdered sugar. sugar. Um, Cause that's what's on the outside. And then as you chew it, you get more of like a carameliness and then you get the hits of pistachio. Um, so sleepy. <sighs> that's because, as an adult, you don't get a sugar rush. No, sugar you go, rush is you sugar go, sleep. You go straight to sugar crash. All right. I gotta. I'm. I'm gonna have to give my my sweet to uh, the pistachio. I think. Um, with I a very you would. with a very close second to the hazel. That's very good. Texture is key. Um, Worst rated for me, by far, this. See, I'm torn on that too. Cause you for can me, have two worst. It's that and it's the durian stuff. I can't, I can't stand the durian stuff. <laughs> it's not good. I like it. And I, like any burps I have, now this is jasmine is still that durian <laughs> stuff 
Yeah, you can get you some Tums it's... or Pepto after this, do you? Oh, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so <clears throat> how long? What, how long oh, we? we're 55 minutes in. Which we is know about how to what talk. We yeah. Um, so, like, comment, and subscribe, and all that fun stuff. Yes. Give us some input on if you like the off videos <clears throat> like this. Mm -hmm. If you have any suggestions on mm -hmm. if Things you want to, yeah. If you want to see us try something different. If you want to try, uh, have us try something. Have ideas for videos. Put them on there too. Yeah. Um, we we're. We've spoken a little bit about a couple of options for other non-food tasting oriented. We have, and we have uh, some stuff in the works. Some stuff in the works, so stay tuned for that. Hopefully soon, we'll be able to do more Let's Play videos, because I haven't been able to do that in literally crazy. months. I think it's been half a year since I've uploaded a Let's Play video. Mm -hmm. I uh, just I've been so busy with our new house and other fun jazz, so uh, it has been fun. In in all seriousness, uh, but it'll be nice to get back into. Uh, it's getting cooler out. Well, supposedly cooler. Yeah. It's getting into fall and winter, so we're gonna have more time to do that, and together uh, because we're gonna have more time together here soon. Mm -hmm. And over time, it's a work schedule. You'll get to see uh, my majestic beard come out until mm -hmm. he shaves it off in in November. Because he starts his no shave November in the summertime and then mm -hmm. gets sick of it by November. Okay, so let us know and we'll see Love you guys, guys. Later. Yes, we do.